Yo, yo, what is up, you guys? Um, so, try to learn, see how to stop the start this video off. I got a new girlfriend. Yeah, I got a new girlfriend. I know, I know. What happened to your, your other girlfriend? I broke up with her. Because she was using me for the money. For the fame, which I don't got. And something else. And on top of that, she was using me to get with her back with her ex. <laughs> Sorry for not to upload for about a month now. Um, see, it, birthday came, Christmas came. It's been six years without my dad's dad, my grandpa, my bestest, bestest friend. And it gets hard for me. There you go for it, sir. Um, seven birthdays now? Six. Seven of mine, six of his. And my great grandfather died last year. He's been gone for two of my birthdays, two two of his and two Chris two Christmases. My grandfather's been gone for one of his birthdays, one of my birthdays and one of Christmas. My my mom's dead. But, anyways, I have to say, I've had a good year. I've had a good run. Yeah, I know, I've done some shit. Everybody fucks up. But, ain't nobody can tell me who I am. And who... I'm gonna be. Because. Oh, I gotta go to. <laughs> but no one can tell me who I am and who I can't be. Because I can only describe me. They can't describe you. <laughs> so if there's somebody that tells you you gotta be somewhere, someone, or how you gotta be, drop them, kick them out. Kick them off your friends list. And don't let them make you you. You gotta describe you. You can't let people make you be who they, who they think you should be. But enough about me. Let's talk about my new girlfriend. Her name is Raven. We've been together for a week now. Um, but well, a week in a day. A week, yeah, a week in a day. Friday was a week. Um, this girl makes me happy. This girl makes me absolutely happy. She's my everything. <laughs> I know she's gonna. She's my everything. But let's talk about why I haven't been uploading in a minute. We'll go back to my girlfriend. Why I haven't been uploading in a good minute? Um. The reason why I haven't uploaded is because the birthday and the Christmas situations. And a week after my birthday, which is December 2nd, so December 9th, I tried to commit suicide. Because there's this girl that's going around saying that I raped her. And there's people coming up to me saying, hey, rapist, if you want to rape somebody, rape me. And I said, no. 
I've had enough. And they were telling me I'm nobody and that I should go kill myself. I let that get to me. Because of the fact that Christmas and holidays are were here. I mean, it's been, I've lost so many people this year already in the past seven years. That mess on me really a lot. But, I mean, I let that make me stronger. I don't let that make me weaker. I let that make me stronger, more powerful. Yeah, I get some money for Christmas, but I mean, it's $540. 20, 40, 1. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, seven, seven forty. My bad. Seven forty. I got two hundred a day from somebody. Um, cause they owe me. But I tried to commit suicide because this little girl was telling me, "Oh, you're not." Tell me that you, I'm a rapist, and if I wanted to rape somebody, I'd rape her. And I was nobody, and that I, it'd be better off if I wasn't even in the world no more. And that's a get to me. So I uh, went into the hospital the 10th, actually, December 10th this month. So 19 years ago. And... I had slipped my wrist. But, I mean, there's scars. There's scars. There's so, so many scars. But, I tried to slip my wrist. I didn't. I was bleeding really bad. And, I was being selfish and I wasn't thinking about what anybody else would think, uh, where my pain would go. I was just thinking about my pain ending, and I would be so fucking happy to finally see my grandpa, my my grandpas, my great grandpas again. And I wasn't thinking; I was too busy thinking about that, than, other than thinking about what would happen to my family and everything, where that that pain would go from me to them. So I was being selfish, real selfish. So I was in there from 12.10 to the, let's see, it was 12.11, when it was 12, 12, Thursday was 12.14, I was there for a whole week, Monday through Friday. But, I got a new computer for Christmas. I got a big make sure. I got a new phone. New phone there. A new phone. Um, that's, you, I have to use my phone for a fucking, see, I can actually see, use you to go, <laughs> it goes on and on, it's like a mirror thing, but, I mean, like I said, I got some stuff for Christmas, I want to see my family. That I haven't seen for a while and I haven't talked to for a while. Um, I dyed my hair. Again. <laughs> dyed my hair again. Back to my natural. Um, so three months is up. I want that. But I'm going gonna, gonna to get blue and purple and mix them together. And then get um, a white kind of color. And put them together. So then I'm going to go. I'm going to dye my hair then. That color. So... One, two, March 28th, three days after my baby's sister's birthday. Um, I'll dye it again. And so, next year, I'm not going to talk to nobody. I'll drop people off that think they're better than me, and people that act like two, act two-faced. Yeah, there's a, actually a, 
better response is that people are two faced, but not like that. One face where they talk, they fuck with you when you're around them, when they're around you, or when they're around your friends, your true friends. Or the second face is they fucking stab you in the back when you're they turn when you turn around and they fucking talk shit about you and everything else. But I've had a lot of those people in my life. Yeah, I know. I fucked up a lot. But the past can't describe who I am. The past can only describe the past me. The future can describe who I am. Because nobody fucking knows the future. Not even me. Only God knows the future. I learned a lot of shit while I was in the hospital. I learned, myself, I learned about myself. Something I didn't know. And... Something I didn't know. And I learned about it. I learned about myself. When I did, it helped me. But enough about me. Back to my girlfriend. She's the sweetest young lady in my, in, <laughs> that's ever came to me. That's ever came in my life. I thank God every day that she came in my life. I thank God every day that she he helped make her 15 years ago. 16 years ago. Some, some shit I get. <laughs> but. I thank God. I wake up every morning with a smile on my face because of her. I know she, she's there for me. And to a vine. A country boy. Like me. I wake up with a smile on my face. But if it wasn't for stupid people, it would last all day. So smack them motherfuckers. Them stupid motherfuckers. Um... <laughs> oh yeah. I got money. I got a computer. I got chair, a chair, a big Mac chair. I got a phone. I got clothes. I got a house. You know, the only thing I need is my girlfriend, my family, clothes, and a bed in the house to sleep in. And sure, yeah, this shit is entertainment. But I also need my phone. No, I'm not saying because I'm going to I'm addicted to my phone. It's because when something's going on, I can call my dad and let him know something's going on. Something happens. I can call my dad and let, know, let him know something happened. And my phone, my computer's right there. But, I mean, my computer's getting ready to ass up my bed. Um, let me come off of this. But anyways, what was I saying? I don't fucking know. <laughs> I don't fucking know. But anyways, let's go back to my girlfriend. She's sweet, she's kind, she's awesome. She's everything to me. Yeah, sure. I don't know if people don't call me a hoe, a hoe and a man whore. But that's your opinion. You're entitled to it. Oh, what I was saying was, I learned a lot of shit in the hospital. I was talking about my girlfriend. <laughs> but she... She helps me every day find who I am still. I, I'm still trying to find who I am. She helps She. I wake up with a smile because of her. I fall in love with her more and more every day. 
She makes me happy. She makes me cry because of how much we love each other. She makes me happy because of her smile, her love for me, my love for her. And to be honest, I wouldn't love nobody else but her. I can't love nobody else but her. Because she means so much fucking more to me than anyone knows. Yeah, my my dad's wife, her mom lives with us, and her boyfriend. Lives with us. He's got a dog. He brings it over every weekend. And they're going to move out. So they're going to move next door. Shut the fuck up. And so. You're saying. She means everything to me. She's not going to be able. She's irreplaceable. She's. So much more than perfect to me. There's no word, no words in this world to describe how much I love her. There's no words in this world to describe how gorgeous she, gorgeous she is to me. I love her with all my heart. My name is Raven, and I'll put her Instagram in link. I got permission from her. I got permission from her. But, I mean... I love her. I'll give her my YouTube channel. I'll give her my like password and shit. So that way she can make videos on my YouTube channel. But I'm gonna go ahead and go. I'm signing. I'm signing off. Um, if you ever need help finding you, just comment in this comment section. Remember, be happy. Peace. Peace.